Alright everybody, welcome back to an episode of 904 Fishing where Kimber does the catching and Alex does the fishing. Oh my god, <laughs> you not only are doing the intro, but you're slandering me in the same motion. Oh my god. I love you. Welcome back. Action. Alright, so we're going to be using the crab uh, fish chunks again. But because they're so big and I don't want to throw two of these out on the same rod, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut these right in half. I'm gonna put these two rods so that way they kind of look like, I don't know, tentacles or something. And then of course, I'm throwing these pink crab fish bites out on Kimber's rod. You can see those are pink there. So, uh, I'm gonna be throwing one of my casting setups out pretty far with these on them, with the crab chunks on them. Uh, Kimber's gonna stay close and then I'm probably gonna put cut mullet on the other two, but I'm not sure yet. I'll leave one in reserve just in case we get something fresh. But right now, that's what we're doing. Oh yeah, definitely got some. Ooh. We got something sideways. It's on the cup bait. Oh, can you jump? Jump a little. What you got? I don't know. See it? Is that a shark? No. It's not a shark. It was swimming kind of like. It's a blue fish. The way it was swimming like that. All right, we're gonna get a live measurement right here. Well, bam. Oh yeah, he's definitely legal. 13 inches. Yeah, baby. Boom. Yeah. Dinner right there. Look at you. I told you. Ah, so there oh, was God, the day, ah, ah. Right? How do you feel about yourself? I feel pretty, pretty good considering I've lost two. <laughs> and then I caught the undersized one. Now I finally catch one <laughs> for dinner. I'm feeling pretty great, honestly. Let's go. <laughs> Good job, baby. That bait, not fresh bait. That was actually frozen bait we caught last time we were here. And I put it in a vacuum sealer at home. That's all I did. Just we like have that. one specifically for bait, and then yeah. we have one for food. Yeah, exactly. So we have one specifically for fish, bait, fish, anything like that. And then we have some for like chicken, steak, all that. So that's just, that's all the bait I'm using right there on a little one-aught hook. A little one-aught hook, cannot talk. That's one of three for me, so hopefully I get another one. All right, so huge shout out to Zach, who I just met. He's, he's the one fishing over there. Uh, we were walking up and Kimber goes, oh, that guy stole our spot, because that's where we were last time when she limited out on Bluefish. And he just walked up and he goes, Alex from 904 Fish. And I'm like, yeah, man, what's up? Turns out, went to high school with him. He I had auto tech with him. Thank you, Zach, for coming up. I'm always happy to say hi to subscribers. Always happy to say hi to just anybody on the beach. So if you guys ever see me out on the beach at any time, make sure to come say hi. But uh, yeah, that was awesome. I love seeing people. You get something? I'm not positive, but this is the one with that the crab chunks on it, you know? Uh-huh. And uh, it had a ton of slack in the line, so I'm not really sure it got with it. I think I feel so. Oh, that one's got something. You want me to? Uh, oh, no. Hey, hang on, hang on. Let me get this one in. Oh, this one definitely has something on it. All right, let me get this one in, then we'll grab that one. Oh, no way. That's what we're here for. Pompano? Pompano. Hey! He's not legal. At least I don't think so. He looks a little short, but... Here, let me just uh, pull out my handy dandy. <laughs> What's the legal size? Uh, for Pompano, I want to say is... Uh, shoot, I can't remember. It's either 10 or a foot. He's a little short regardless, so we're going to throw him back just to be, you know, conservative about it. Oh, yeah. That one's definitely got... See, all right, look over. Yeah. Look over that other one. See how it's sat down like that? Yeah. I need this guy something. We're going to get this guy thrown back real quick. And then we'll grab that one. Go, go, go. You guys have it? Like it? Oh, yeah. Look at that tip moving. We definitely got something. And then, okay, that, okay, that one's not out. That one's out. What? Oh, I was just, I thought I, thought I had another two rods out over here, over here but I don't. All right, fish predictions. What do you think it is? Uh, Nemo. It's ne. Oh my God, we found Nemo. Oh, I know what that is. Blue. Maybe. You gotta see. It's a blue fish. <laughs> bring it up here. No, you're good to reel up. Because there's no water here, so we don't have to worry about it. I think that's a keeper. 
Oh yeah, that's definitely a keeper. Oh, that's a big one. All right, you wanna grab a measurement real quick? Yeah. That's a good one. Look at that. Uh, oops, shit. Oops. Fork. A 13 inch. Belt. Yeah. He's legal. Oh, all right, he's legal. We're gonna throw him, throw him in the cooler. It's definitely something. Hell yeah. The way it's pulling and the way it's fighting strikes me as another uh, pompano. It's kind of swimming sideways. Wait a minute. Yep. No. What? Is that a jack? That's a jack revolve. It's a jack revolve. That's a tiny little jack. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> nice little jack revolve. He was super fat. I could have gotten some good plays off him, but um, wait until they get a little bigger. You got something? Yeah. Walk up. Let's walk up, because I think we lost it in the shallows last time. Super cool pink rod, pink line. All right. Oh yeah, I feel it now. Oh I yeah? I thought I lost it for a second. Well, Feel good? Yeah. You think it's another bluefish? It's gotta be like right there. Yeah, but is that shark fish? Probably not. But oh, I'm that was cool. It's a bluefish. Yeah. Don't record it in the water. Pull it up. Yeah, he's definitely undersized. See what I mean? He's not happy. All right, you got him. Let's go. Let's walk up here. Can you get the hook out? Oh, we're getting. Oh, we're getting another one. We're getting another one. Yeah. Let's put this in the rod holder. That one? No, that one's definitely not a keeper. You can measure him, but I'm pretty sure. Got something on this one too. But I don't have a free hand. So we're, we're doing it like this. Looks like a yeah. You wanna measure him just for sure? I can do it. Okay. <laughs> okay. I mean it's up to you. He's not super fat. It's up to you. Okay. You want to keep him? Sure. What? Oh, okay. So I just limited out on bluefish. Um, all my bluefish were like 13, 14 inches. I think I'm measuring wrong because I'm measuring to the end of like the skin. I think it's to like where the end of the fork is. So I think that they're, they're definitely legal, but I think it's closer to 14 inches than 13 inches. But I like to be on the conservative side just to be on the safe side. Um, that's the first time I have uh, limited out on fish in a while. I mean, a long time. So, Kimber's got one more bluefish she can catch. I'm hoping for some pompano on those uh, far rods that we have with the crab chunk bites out on it. Um, it's been a, it's just, it's been a great day of fishing. What do you think? 10 out of 10. You should definitely have something on that. You feel it? Oh yeah. All right. Definitely have something on this. I'm gonna try to get some water shots of it. Yeah? She thinks it's something huge. That rod's been awfully hard. Yeah, keep coming in. Oh, wow. It's jumping, it's jumping. What is it? Oh, it's a nice blue fish. It's a nice blue fish. Oh, it's a big blue fish. It's a big blue fish. Where'd it go? There it is. Oh, 
Oh, it's a nice big fat bluefish too. Nice. That's a nice one. You hooked him twice. Yes, he, like, he was hugging. There you go. It's probably because he was hooked on both. All right, that's your limit. We both got our limit. Well, let me let me measure it. Oh, he's legal. I don't. That's care. probably the Here, biggest one of the day. I got one here. All right, it. lock it. Ah! Here, now yeah, do it like that. All right, at uh, the tip. Yep, definitely legal. All right, hold it up. Nice. All right. Oh my God. All right, that's uh, that's our limit. That's it. Definitely. That's all we can catch for bluefish. I don't think we've both limited. You got the line. You got the line. We've got Kimbra. We've got. Oh, all right. She got off. There you go. Beat for free. Oh yeah, that's definitely. Fun. Told you. You're right. You never listen to me. Yet here I am, the catcher man. And you are yeah, the fish. It's another jack! What? Watch it. Watch the spines yeah, on the one. Yeah, never mind. He's really slippery. It's broken. <laughs> We haven't caught any Kroger's. We have not in a while. That's weird. That's weird. I know white lighting today. That guy caught lighting, but. All right, so you guys hear that? I'm trying to get the mic. So what that is, is in the back of his mouth, he's got these chompers, these crushers. And he's, he's flexing those together. And when he does that, it makes that <laughs> sound. He's That's like, not a bad one. He's fat. Look how fat he they is are. Really fat. Do you want to keep that one? Uh, I mean, I love Jack Carval. People say Jack Carval is a crash or a trash fish. I like it. I think it's a great fish. Since I made you keep the one that yeah, I caught. So, yeah, that exactly. Time. Yeah, Kimbra was, it was like really good. yeah, it, it was, was really good. It, it had a very firm consistency. It was a lot like tuna, in my opinion. Um, this one's small, but that's going to be perfect lunch size for me. We get two little fillets there with a little bit of rice, a little bit of beans. Lunch. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching another episode of 9 to 4 Fishing. We both got our bag limit today. It was an awesome day. She obviously taught me a thing or two about fishing. Um, anything to add? Nothing to add. She got bit off of her line. We think he got shark because uh, Bray doesn't have any abrasion resistance. So whenever it gets into something coarse or like shark skin or big scales or something like that, it just cuts. That's what happens. Whereas Mono kind of frays a little bit. So great day of fishing. I got a bunch of fish to go home and clean. So we're going to go do that. Thank you guys for tuning in. See you guys next time.